Hi guys, it's Monica. I am going to share with you a wig review. This wig was actually sent to me complimentary from Wig Studio One so that I could share it with you all. You know, hair loss and everyone has a different journey with hair, right? Some of you, I often say this, some of you have been blessed with a full, beautiful, gorgeous, thick head of hair and uh, some not, right? And so my hair is on the thin side and I find wearing toppers and wearing fake buns, as I call them, or wraps, I, I find that it enhances, and even like little trendles at times, it enhances my bio hair, which is on the thin side. I also love wearing them because then it saves on processing my hair. I don't have to have my roots done as much, etc. But I can wear a topper, I can get away with that. However, some people can't. So for some people, a full wig is the way to go. And I often, you know, I often really relish the opportunity to try different looks, different colors, different styles, different manufacturers, because I manufacture or different companies, because I think sometimes the more I can share with those of you that aren't, are on a hair journey, being at hair loss, so you just want to have different looks and all of that, that you can actually see what it looks like on a real person. That's how I often look at it. So I might review pieces that I won't wear personally day to day because maybe the color is wrong or it's just too much of a dramatic change for me from my bio hair that I wear every day to work, sometimes with a topper, sometimes with a bun, sometimes not. Sometimes I just wear it the way it is. So for me, all of a sudden to come out with this, everyone would obviously see a dramatic difference. But if you didn't know me and I wore this out, you may not know. You know, uh, some of the wigs and the hair pieces today are just, they're not, they're not your grandmother's wigs anymore. They're, they're not, they're not your grandmother's wigs. And this particular one, Ellen Villa, this is called Flip Mono. Now I have this in Nougat Rooted, and I really love the color. So I have done a review for Wig Studio One. I'm gonna close everything that I did here, but I just wanted you guys to see it as well because I like to share these looks with you. So Ellen Villa, Wig Studio One, complimentary. If you're curious about the details and the review, stay tuned. If you are into brunette shades and short, sassy styles, you are gonna absolutely love this brand new piece. So let me just tell you a little bit. I think I'm super excited about the color as well. So this is Nugget Rooted, and they say this is a medium light ash brown blended with medium honey blonde on medium and dark brown roots. To me, it isn't, um, it isn't a medium light ash brown. I'm seeing more of a medium darker brown blended with, at, with golden blonde and lighter ash brown. I'm loving the rooting pattern. I'm loving the highlight pattern of this piece. I don't know if it's gonna pick it up here, but I'm gonna show you some outside pictures here of me walking in the yard so you can see what it looks like in the natural light. This is really a pretty piece. And again, like I said, if you're into you know, short hair and you want something that's classic, but something that is fun, this is going to be it. This is uh, part of the Hair Power Collection from Ellen Villa, and this is called Flip Mono. They describe this as a refined, ultra-modern, look that will turn heads wherever you go. It has a beautiful lace front. It has a monofilament cap, really nice ear tabs that stay put, and a Velcro adjusters in the back so that you can cinch it in if you need or cinch it out if you want. I have a 22 inch circumference. This fits me like a glove, fits really nice on me. So this is the type of style that if you are into bangs, you can comb this straight down if you'd like, or you can flip it like I have it split a little bit. I have it split a little bit. You can punk this up. You can take some piece out gel and, and set it up if you want or you can wear it down, more refined. The edges are so super cute. With all the little flip edges, it just really is adorable. I really like this. This is super amazing. I think the, the versatility of this look. 
So let's see what else it says. Um, so this is, like I said, a lace front. Lace front is very, very nicely done and it has a monofilament top. I've done nothing to this. I just took it out of the box and shook it. But if you wanted to put some styling product in it, you could probably fluff it up in a completely different way or tame it down if that's what you really would like. You can wear this tucked behind the ears completely with a little bit of fringe in the front, or you can just comb it all forward. Really awesome. I really love it. The back has little flips, so it's textured, comes up in a flip. Really a... Um, Hmm. I would definitely say a fuss-free look. So this was sent to me complimentary from Wig Studio One, as I said, so you could take a look at it. And I think oftentimes, you know, you see a lot of the blondes, but you don't often see a ton of the brunettes. And many of us really like brunettes. Now, I gravitate towards the blonde looks, but this is really cute. I really like this. So the, um, the hair fiber is synthetic, so it's a shake and go. The front is about three inches. The crown is three and a half. The sides are three and the nape in the back is 2.5. Absolutely beautiful. And if you're not into brunettes, check out the website. Let me do another little closer look for you. Check out Wig Studio One's website. Check out all the different colors that you can see this in. This is really a nice piece. I hope you like it as much as I do. I think it's adorable. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.